Hey, nerdlings! What up, muggle do, nerdlings? Do you nerd for another Wizarding World crate? That's right! It's time for another Wizarding World crate. This... What? This is November 2019's Wizarding World Crate! So you mean you, we didn't have to wait a whole six months or more for this one? Not this one! Well, I don't even know what to do now. After this crate, we're only behind one, January's, so we'll see! Alright, any idea on the theme this time Again, around? no! No idea what the theme is, no emails, no card, no nothing, so... Well, they can't be bothered with that. I know! Far too busy being behind. You'll have to excuse my friend. He's a little slow. We have our button. The button. Now, I think the last one was an animal, so I'm guessing that maybe they're just going to keep going with the There's uh, a lot of magical creatures, beasts. yes. Yes. So what animal do you think this one is? Uh, you know what? Let's go with something a little more standard. Have you gotten a unicorn yet? I don't believe we've gotten a oh, unicorn yet. the land of unicorns, <laughs> there's no need for clothing. And we have not gotten a Niffler yet. And people seem to really like mm. the Nifflers. Alright, let's see what it is. Oh, close. It's Buckbeak. Buckbeak. Buckbeak is my freak because she makes me feel dirty. <laughs> that is cool. It's not quite as colorful as the... Akami that we got last time, but it's still pretty. It still has that like pearl eyes look to it. Ah, ah, it's killed me. It's killed me. It's killed me. It's killed me. All right, let's get you off to the hospital wing. Actually, yeah, that that is kind of nice. Like you said, that pearl look to it, mm -hmm. but then it's almost like a gold trim mm -hmm. around the yeah. borders. And that's a that's a big pin. It is I a mean, very big pin. It'd be a very uh, prominent piece. Nice. nice, very Just nice. Not. Yes. Just remember your manners around Buckbeak. We have a Hogwarts Express motion pin. Oh, uh, when the Hogwarts Express is in motion, don't come a notion. <laughs> Get him! the hell out of my studio all right so we have a really nice faux velvet lined box right here and a cutout for the pin so they're being very fancy the train moves to hogwarts as you move it up and down it's kind of neat just that fun uh classic motion pin design yeah that you'd always see in like the gift shops of tourist traps. yeah you know <laughs> My dad had a pin like this. Let's not talk about the but pin it had your a dad had. Different kind of motion, <laughs> and um, I might have been a little more sold if this one <laughs> were like one of those pins with uh, I don't know, maybe Hermione or Luna. Or or Luna. Oh yeah. It does say platform nine and three quarters on it, and it's a uh, twist pin. Well, this is a really nice pin in the it box is. that it came yes. in. The funny thing is, it almost seems like this is the gift that you would get after retiring yeah. as uh, maybe the trolley witch or the there conductor. There you go. And they're like, great, I spent my entire life on the train. You're going to give me a pin with the for, train on it. For many fine years of your trolley witch services, we would like to present you with this pin and no severance pay. Please do not let the castle doors hit you on the way out. Sounds about right. All right, we have a wooden plaque. And it says, please forward all gifts to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. So it's like basically like an out to lunch sign or something. Okay with Hedwig on That's it. kind of That's, neat. Yeah, it's cute. You know, this really has that look and design of something that we would see from all of the events and conventions it that does. we go to. It One really does, yeah. Items. It's and a I, little distress. Yeah, uh -huh. I think that's kind of what I like the most about it because it does have that feel of being like a homemade gift. 
Nice. Nice. Next, we have it says Hogwarts House Holiday Platter. Okay. It's a very tiny platter. It's for the house elves. I guess so. Okay. So it seriously is. It's a Hufflepuff colors. And then it's got the Hogwarts symbol on the inside of it. And it's, I can't read Latin. Draco. Plato. Dorminus. Verata. Nunquam. <laughs> Tittlendups. <laughs> I said. I'm a child. I said tittle. Oh, you. <laughs> so it's plastic. This seems odd by itself, but yeah. I wonder, do you think there's a full set that you could have all four houses. I in feel the small like platters. it, yes. At first, I wasn't quite liking it because I was like, okay, it's the Hogwarts in the middle, but it's my house on the outside. But then it's like, well, it does kind of combine the best of both worlds. So the more I look at it, the more I like it. But it, I definitely wouldn't call this a platter. I mean, I guess they went holiday because there's like a wreath around the outside of, of the Hogwarts symbol. Grab a cup of tea, put your biscuits on there. I think you'd be good to go. Had this come in November when it was supposed to, this probably this and this Christmassy gifts thing would probably make a little bit more sense. So I'm yeah. guessing maybe it's the theme might have been Christmas at Hogwarts, maybe. That makes sense. Um, yeah, because like even the motion train pin mm -hmm. could be like going back home for the holidays exactly. or anything. But yeah, uh, at this point, you know, a few months after yeah. the holidays, it's kind of hard <laughs> to have that holiday mindset. But it's, I, I mean, they're cute. I like them. We have one more thing in the box. Oh, it's a pillow. Nice. That's cute. And it's the jumpers that Ron and Harry got. I, I recognize the R. Yes. That very much looks so like his. So Ron's sweater or Harry's sweater. So that's cool. So you can. That's pretty good. Whatever way you wanted it to be. Uh, you know what? You put this on the pillow, and look how fancy it is. Oh, you're so fancy, my lady. Your biscuits also. Why, thank you, sir. She just crumbled them up with the plate again. <laughs> How else do you eat cookies? Um, nom, 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 nom. I always kind of liked Ron's jumper. You know, he wasn't mm -hmm. a fan of it, but I was like, I don't know. That's kind of cool looking. Yeah, there. but it's one of those things when you get one every year, you do kind of get tired of it. Fair enough. Because, I mean, Harry was super stoked about his, and all he cared about was that he actually got a present. But. It smells like my great aunt Tessie. <laughs> Murder me, Harry. Now, the inside of the box is just symbols for, of the houses. Snakes! So snakes and badgers and ravens or eagles and lions. And tigers. And bears. Oh my! It does seem very much like the theme was holidays. Yes. How do you think they did with the theme, if that were the case? If that were the case, I think they did a pretty good job. Like I said, you know, we've got the Christmas presents and the, you know, the wintry scene here. We've got the wreath on the little... So, I mean, I guess you could put your cookies out to Santa. The pillow is a clever idea because it's their Christmas sweaters. It's not very Christmassy. Right. So you can go either way with it. You could leave it out all year round or only put it out at Christmas time because it's their Christmas jumpers. Right, so, so. some options there, mm -hmm. that's nice. Um, nom, nom. And the box just as a whole, what do you think? It's not a bad box. Um, I'm still trying to figure out what was taking so long to get <laughs> the last two boxes to us. Yeah, it's not a bad box. It's not a bad box at all. It's not one of my favorites of theirs that they have done. Just kind of a, a standard, typical box. This felt more like a introductory box or a welcome box. Mm -hmm. One more. One more that we're behind. Past box. Yes. And then to be caught up. All right. Are you yeah. ready? Are you eagerly awaiting the next I one? I am. I am. I'm hoping to see if they can catch themselves back up. All right, we'll see you guys in eight months then with the next box. <laughs> well, nerdlings, please, if you happen to like the video, give it a like and leave some comments down below. What do you think of the uh, the pillow, the sign, the motion pin? Did, did you guys have one of the motion pins that, uh, you know, that he's talking had? about? Uh, what about the platter? Is, is this a platter for you or maybe more of a snack size? See, this seems to me more size. like I'm going to like come home and like put my keys or my change on it.
Well, there you go. You can do that, too, <laughs> until you get the other houses, I guess. I know. Collect the whole set. I, that is kind of silly. I do think they, in this regard, they should have given you the whole set. That, There's only four. That would have been nice. I mean, it's made out of plastic. You get all four houses. It's Christmas at Hogwarts, for heaven's sakes. You know? So <laughs> they're, they're not thinking about giving them. I guess not. Well, leave those comments <laughs> down below. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And stick around to see if the next one... When it gets here. Pseudo on time and if they get <laughs> caught up again. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we have merchandise over there. Go over to the Retro Refresh because we've got a great bunch of guys over there to uh, hang out and chit chat with. And we talk to you on time there. And if we like it. We nerd it. Arr. Look, it's it's an R for Retro Refresh or just for pirates. Arr. Arr. <laughs> yo ho yo ho a wizard's life for me i don't think the wizards were pirates <laughs> my nerdlings okay ready nope stuck on the thingy okay ready yes would be sep no ready we have a hogwarts express 